Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. Um, now, this episode or this video is gonna be a vlog up in Cairns. So, I used to live in Cairns. I grew up there from the age of about 10 to like 22, 23. I came down to Brisbane in 2018 and then I moved down to the Gold Coast last year. But um, yeah, I'm going back home to help my parents move house. Staying at my grandparents' holiday house. Oh, it's like an apartment on the beach at Palm Cove. So it's in a good spot, it's right near the beach. I'll be doing, I got the race coming up next weekend so I need to keep on top of my training with running. I am starting to taper so I won't be doing any crazy crazy running but I'm starting to taper down and yeah we're getting we're getting ready for that race next weekend so that's what this video is gonna be I'm gonna show you cans what I get up to around there um, so yeah let's get into this video all right guys now I am traveling this weekend so um, why not go through and show you guys a bit of um, kind of what how I stay on track when I'm traveling so I will be taking supplements up I will be taking my scales which I've only recently probably started um, weighing food a little bit more it's more so like just so I don't overeat and go crazy because um, yeah I'm in a bit of a slight like calorie surplus at the moment but also don't want to be going and overeating way too much food um, so yeah, I'm gonna show you the essentials that I'm gonna be taking up to Cairns and give you guys a little insight into how I stay on track when I travel. All right guys, there we have it. Whey protein, got a heap in there. Creatine, electrolytes. We got um, Endura in there. And we got some pre-workout. Pre-workout there as well. And a heap of oats, which I can probably buy up there. So I will be taking my scales as well, and I'll take my vitamins up as well. Now, one thing you might say is like, oh, you, you don't need to take all that stuff. Like it's only a few days, but it's like, do you, do you wanna be good at something? Do you actually care and wanna put in 100% effort into it? Because if you think about anything as like a competition or just thinking about, having pride in what you do, why wouldn't you want to put it in, put in 100%? Um, because when it comes to the results, that's when everything shows. So with like running training, um, when I do a race, everything that I've done over the past few months comes down to one day. Um, it's the same if, you, if you're doing a bodybuilding competition or something like that. Um, so. If you care about something, go the extra mile and put the extra effort in because it pays off in the long run. And you know someone else out there that you might be up against is doing all these things and you're just sitting back thinking, oh, it's all right, I won't, I won't do it. So um, if you're gonna do something, put in 100% and this is what it takes to be good at something sometimes. You just need to put the extra effort in and go hard. And <laughs> It pays off and when the results, when you get those results, that's when you know it's all worth it. All right guys, everyone's favorite part. <laughs> Pack my suitcase. I think I've got everything. We've got running hats there. I've got shoes. I'll probably, if I go out or something, I'll probably just wear the Nike Dunks. I don't think we're going camping now, unfortunately. I think we've got too much stuff to do with the house and that, so. Got the Saucony Endorphin Speed 2s, got the Nike Invincible runs, so I'm pretty much done with my speed runs for now, so they're just gonna be easy runs, so that's why I got those two options. We got the slides there. We got the supplements all in there, yes, I'm taking them. We got the tripod, laptop, and then just pretty much clothes, and then over here, we've just got camera, or oh, the yeah, gear, I've got my hard drive and stuff. All the essentials, got the camera bag, and obviously I've got the camera in my hand. So we are ready to go, and I'll see you guys up in Cairns. All right, guys, we've made it. It's been a long day. Um, I'm at the apartment. I'll give you a little tour in a minute, but it's been a massive day. I'm just about to head off to train, so I'm gonna show you guys a full chest workout. 
It's pretty late. Um, we just had Thai for dinner um, at my par parents' old place that we're moving out of. I'm at the apartment now, and yeah, like I said, um, I'll give you a quick tour, and then we're gonna hit a chest workout, and then I'll try to show, show you guys a few more things over the weekend, but I don't think we'll be going away anywhere, but plenty of content to, yeah, just shoot a little bit of stuff around, around Cairns, show you how I used to live, where I used to train, the gym that I'll be going to is where I used to train every single day. Um, so some good men <laughs> memories from there. Um, let's give you a little tour of the gym. <laughs> My head's fried, it's been a long day. I mean the apartment, let's give you a little tour. All right, let's start at the entrance. Let's do it. All right, lounge room here. And as we go down here, we got bathroom, nothing interesting. We got a bedroom here, I think that's where I'll be sleeping. I've got a couple single beds there. I've got a balcony out the back. Oh, I can give you a, a better tour of outside when it's daytime. Got a nice kitchen here. Have a go at this, the memory book wall. There's Pa, Legend, all the family, all the cousins what the holiday apartment's about. <laughs> Spending time together with family. All right, we got the main bedroom. I think my brother and his girlfriend are staying in here. We got a big on suite in there, big spa bath, which if you open these up, you can look straight out there to the ocean. So, here we got second big lounge room. This is a massive apartment, yeah. This is where I'll be staying for a few days, and we're in Palm Cove, Cairns. But for the moment, we gotta go smash this chess session.
Oh, what's up guys? Sorry if the lighting's a bit shit in here. We just finished up a massive chest session. Um, so yeah, we started heavy on bench. Um, then we moved to some Smith Machine incline. Um, we did about, well, with the bench, we, we did about six to seven sets. We, we pyramid up in weight and then we dropped back down. Smith Machine, um, barbell press, we did about four sets. Um, incline dumbbell press, again, we did about three or four sets and then we went to, on to a few different variations of flies. Actually did, I think, like four different variations or something. Um, did about three sets on each of those, about 10 to 12, so high reps. Um, and then we also did that, um, the plate press kind of just across the body, great for um, really just keeping tension on that chest and squeezing the shit out of it. Um, yeah, that was an intense session. I think I was there for like an hour and a half, but since I'm up in Cairns and I'm not really sure what I'm doing while I'm here, I just thought um, let's jam as much content um, into this vlog as much as we can. So it's tw it's 9.43 right now on my watch. Um, oh yeah, I haven't had much food today, but I've got my supplements that are packed. So I think we're gonna have some protein oats for dinner, which dinner obviously is gonna be at like 10 o'clock, which is all good, but I'm gonna get a good night's rest. Um, and then, yeah, I'm going to show you guys a few other things across the weekend. But, yeah, I'm going to get some rest and wake up at 5 for a run in the morning. So, lovely stuff, but we love it. So, I'll see you guys soon. We have it, workout done. 10 days, kept that heart rate high. And this is the view. I'm going to show you guys a little bit better now. Not bad at all. We made some brekkie. I usually have oats, but I felt like eggs. So we got two whole eggs and four extra egg whites. And two pieces of toast with some Vegemite. And nice view. All right, guys. We're at the house that I grew up in. Dad's given me the Ranger, the beast to drive for the weekend. So I thought I'd give you a little tour of where I used to live. I'm not sure if any of you guys have been following me since the days I used to live here, but if you have, thanks for the support. <laughs> you guys have been here for a while then. But most of this stuff is moved out already. I've got the boat there, big carport, mum's car. We'll go inside, you can, meet, you can meet the dogs. Where are they? Billy! <laughs> Little Billy man. Hey, come here. Billy! Billy, come on. Alrighty, laundry. Little yard out there. South side yard. Like I said, a lot of the stuff's been moved out of here already. Mum and Dad's room. Some stuff still in here. <laughs> Look at this crazy dog. Hey. <laughs> oh, he's got too much energy. As you can see, we're moving everything out. A few little bits and pieces in here. Oh look, it's Peppy. <laughs> Peppy's mum's dog. 
Hello Kitty. Hey. Anyone else comes here, she barks like crazy. <laughs> Kitchen and stuff. Just a media room. Not much in there now, or nothing in there, but that's this little TV room. This is just like another room that we had. Bathroom in here. This is me and my brother's room, so my brothers were in those two rooms, they're pretty basic. They don't have anything in there now, but we got that one. Spare. But this is my old room. This is where the magic used to happen. And the selfies were taken in that mirror there. And I'll show you the pool area out the back. Right, out here we have the outside area. Gonna miss this backyard. Used to have so much fun out here. Such a nice pool and garden and stuff. Really feels like you're in Bali or something <laughs> when you come up here. Such a beautiful day as well. Perfect temperature. Pretty much the rest of the backyard. And we've got Dad's shed out here. That's pretty much it. You gonna say hey? Uh, look at the size of her compared to my hand. <laughs> hey. Really? A little string bean. Murphy would love these too. He's met Peppy. Murphy's met Peppy, but he hasn't met Billy. Happy Bill. All right, guys. I managed to do a little food shop earlier today. Got some avocados. I cooked up some beef mince, lean beef mince. Got that with some rice there. I'm gonna have that before I head to gym soon. I got some bananas. Got a few essentials: some bread, some cheese, some. Some, got some chicken there that I need to cook up as well. Got some crumpets for pre-workout. And then we got a, some rice, just a few other small bits and pieces. Making sure I stay on track. Just wrapped up my last run here in Cairns. Did um, 
8Ks, so we're slowly just starting to taper now. Got the race on Sunday, it's currently Tuesday, um, but we're gonna wrap up this Cairns vlog. I'm sorry that I couldn't get any kind of interesting content. I'll probably still put this together and just put together what I've got. Um, and yeah, we got a workout on there, a few runs and stuff like that. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. You can check out the places, the house that I used to live in and stuff like that. But um, anyway, thanks for watching and see you on the next video.